Hi friends, welcome back. And if it's your first time here, I'm so excited that you are here. My name is Heidi and today we are gonna be doing a workout with just your motor arm. We're gonna do arms, we're gonna do abs and we're gonna have a lot of fun doing that. Before I forget, don't forget to subscribe to my channel and hit the bell so you're notified when the next video drops. Are you ready to get this party started? Let's do it. Okay, so you have no major changes in this workout. You're literally gonna have your feet in the straps, the resistance at three pounds, so all buttons out the entire time with the motor arm in your hand. So that takes that out of the equation. So let's go ahead and start. You're gonna be in a seated upright position here and we're gonna take the hands in a supinated position, so palms up. We're gonna take the arm straight out and with that exhale, we're gonna curl, rolling to the back of the sits bones. I want you to hold. Bicep curl for one and then restack sitting tall. Again, rolling it back, exhale. We curl, we take it forward and we restack. So the higher the arms are in the space, the more your shoulders are gonna work. So keep that in mind. Exhale, inhale, restack. One more like that, we curl it back. We bicep curl, now hold, and let's do five more. Exhale, last four. Exhale for three, last two. One more, arms extend. You're gonna restack. Let's add a little bit to this. We're gonna curl it back, roll it back. Bicep curl. Now from here, you're gonna extend the arms overhead as you elongate the spine, lifting the heart, and then curl it back in. So we're extending through the shoulders, through the elbows. We're lengthening here the spine, tipping the pelvis forward, and then we curl it back. So getting a little like spinal undulation, if you will. Two more, we lengthen and we curl. One more, we lengthen. I'm pressing my heels into the floor and I curl. Good, take the arms forward, restack the spine, sit tall. Good, take it down. Now, from here, you're gonna flip the palms over, arms come back up. We're gonna curl it back, rolling down to the tips of our shoulder blades here. Draw your elbows into the rib, draw your knees to tabletop hold right here. From here, on your exhale, you're gonna extend the legs, extend the arms, and then pull it in. Again, we reach and we bring it in. Two more like that and I'm gonna change it up. Hello triceps, I'm feeling it. Last one, I pull it in. Now from here, I'm gonna keep my arms here. I'm gonna extend and then reach. I extend the legs and I reach the motor arm over my knees. I extend and I reach. Two more, I extend, taking the legs as low in the space without losing my imprint and bend. Come all the way back, keep your tabletop, release it back. Ah, let the head and neck relax. Drop the shoulders into their socket, hold. From here, we're gonna take it into double leg stretch. You're gonna send that motor arm over the knees, lifting the head, neck and chest. Together as a unit, arms overhead, legs shoot away. Exhale, pull it in. Again, inhale, exhale, pull. We reach, exhale, pull, three more, exhale, pull, we have two more, exhale, last one there, we pull it in, hold right here, I'm going to send my left leg straight, I'm going to take that arm to the outside of my top knee, and then switch, <sighs> and switch. Now you're gonna find that no, the resistance is not too heavy. You're gonna feel a little bit of feedback on the hips itself. It's gonna feel as if you wanna pull the hips off the mat, keep them nice and square here. Last four. 
exhale for three. I'm doing a funky toe point because I don't want to lose my strap. Last two. And last one. Knees to tabletop. Reach up and over. Take it all the way back. Lengthen the spine. Ah, reach. Going into a roll up, friends. Dropping the shoulders in. Anchoring the ribs down. Oh, I'm wearing a sports bra today, so you can see it all. Oh, my goodness. Here we go. Taking that arm forward. We're going to lift the head, neck, and chest. Squeeze those inner thighs. Woo, dive it forward. Keep the energy in your shoulders. And exhale, roll it back down. Sending it back. Uh, again, arms come forward. Exhale, lift the head, neck, and chest. Diving it through. Inhale. Exhale, we roll it back down. Sending the arm back overhead. Ribs are anchored. It's like an elongated contraction of your center. Again, we're going to add it on. Roll it up. Now, restack the spine. Draw that motor arm into your chest. Now hold. We're going to curl. Keep the motor arm in your chest. Can you do it all the way down? All the way down. Oh, my goodness. Shoulder press up. Yes, you guys are seeing my flaws right here. I'm not perfect. Oh, heaven forbid. Exhale, lift the head, neck, and chest. If you know me, you know that roll-ups are not my favorite. <laughs> We're going to pull it in. At least they're not my best, but I try. That's all that matters. We're going to curl, pressing the heels down into the mat. Woo! Send the motor arm overhead for a little shoulder press. Last one. We're going to take it forward. Lifting it up. Restack the spine and row here for eight and seven. Think shoulder blades sliding towards each other. And five, growing tall. Last three. Exhale for two. One more and bring it down. Very nice. So we're going to set up. I'm going to adjust. We're going to set up for a little side bend series. Going into your side bend, you're going to take your hand in an under grip right in the center of your motor. Today, my top leg is going to be in back, and you are going to see why, because it's going to help us with our transition. Your opposite hand is down on the mat. We're lengthening the bottom side of that rib cage, pushing the mat away so that shoulder blade is locked in place here. And from there, we're going to push into the feet. Sending that motor arm up for shoulder press and then bring it back down. Just tap the hip for more. We press. We bring it down. Last three. We press. We bring it down. Final two. Up and down. Last one. We bring it up. Now, from here, you're going to take the motor arm. We're going to bring it around. Yes, you are twisted. I want you to hold. We're going to unravel. Woo! Yes, did you do it? It's okay if you did it. You can bring the knees down. You're going to hold right there. Wrist and shoulders are in line. You're going to point that right foot. Lift and lower for eight and seven and six. Last five, four, three, two. And one, replace the foot, hold right there. Here we go. Push up, you can lower your knees if you need it. Elbow skim the ribs, we go down and up for three. Down and up for two. Down and up for one. Lower your knees and press it back. Woo, good. Take a moment. You can turn to the other side or for me, I'm just going to turn so I'm facing you so you don't have to look at my backside. And we're going to do it all over again. So you're here. Hand is up. Supinated position. I'm going to take my feet, top leg back, bottom leg forward. Hand is down. Here we go. Side bend. Push it up. Exhale. Inhale. Again, nice little shoulder press. And bring it down. Last three, and down. This one's not easy. Last two, we bring it down. One more, good. 
Hold. Now we're going to unravel. Bring it down. Yes. It's not fancy, friends. I was hoping it would be, but it's not. We're going to hold right there. We're going to point that left foot. Lift and lower for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, on one. Lower the foot, lower the knees if you need it. Three more push ups down and up. Last two. Last one. Woo! Almost didn't get that one. Press it back. Woo! Here we go. One more thing here, friends. Bring yourself down. We're going to keep our feet in the straps here. You're going to use your whole mat as you lower yourself down onto your belly. Little back extension. We're right here. I've done this in a previous video before. You can check that one out. <laughs> so we're here. I'm going to lock my pelvis into place, pressing my pubic bone into the mat. From there, on an inhale, I'm going to reach through the toes, through the opposite arm, and bring it down. Whew. And switch. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale, reach. Exhale, down. Inhale. Exhale. So we're getting the sling systems, that posterior sling. We're getting your back extensors, shoulders, hips. All the things. One more set. Inhale. Exhale. Last one. Bring it down. Ah. Take a moment. Bring the motor into your chest. Push it back. Round it out. And breathe. Whew. That was a short one. But it was a burner. At least it was for me. <laughs> Thank you so much for joining me today. Don't forget to hit that like button, comment below, and if you're interested in one-on-one -on -one online sessions, contact me. I'll put my information below. In the meantime, take care, and I'll see you again soon.